Hey guys, welcome to Drupal Noob. Today we are going to see how to leverage WebP support on Drupal. So, in order to do this, uh, your Drupal version should be Drupal 9.2.0. Now, also, your server should have the capability to support webp images now let's go ahead and get started so i've already created an article content now i'm gonna upload a normal jpeg image to this article now, as you can see here the size of the JPEG is 786 KB the purpose of uh, using WebP over any other formats is they are much smaller in size and the image is still of better quality so this will give you a better performance at all cost now go ahead and uploading the image Now, as you can see the image is uploaded I'm gonna go ahead and inspect the image and while inspecting clearly you can see the sizes as as I've uploaded it is 786 KB and the rendered size and the aspect ratio and uh, other stuffs now how can we make this to a WebP image let's go ahead and create a new image style and image style let's just name this as webp and we can add an effect as convert we can add so extension is webp and click and add effect and then save it now let's go back to the article and let's go to the content type article and manage display as you can see the image is here click on the settings now we are rendering the original image now we have to choose our custom image style webp click on update and then go ahead and save it now if you go back to the home page click on the article as you can see the quality doesn't stain however while inspecting the image you can see the file size is being reduced to 332 KB that is a lot of as you can see it's better the file image size has been reduced also Let's go ahead and click on the network tab and keep loading the page as you can see here the size and the load time is 45 milliseconds so this is how you can leverage webp image support on a drupal 9 thanks for watching